we've got Midnight out. He's just entering his uh, third <coughs> week with us of training. We've been starting to push him a whole lot farther as far as his obedience training is concerned and also working with him on his confidence. Um, he was very, very nervous and startled by a lot of different objects, different sounds, um, cats, rooster, ducks. You can see we've got all kinds of pieces of equipment out here. Um, just kind of, you know, he was really, really nervous, really shy about a lot of these things. So we've been, you know, just trying to develop um, his confidence in himself and his ability to still work with his handler. Midnight. Cup. So you can see he can be focusing on different stuff. You can call him back over to you and he'll come to you to get ready to start doing a little bit of work. Great midnight. That's a good boy. You sit. Yes, good boy. We've got him uh, on just a little bit of agility equipment here. Uh, it took quite a while to get him confident in his feet work, getting up and down off of this equipment. It's a pretty narrow staircase up to a narrow walkway. Yeah, that's a good boy. You sit. Yes, good boy. Down. You can see he's very, very comfortable with the agility equipment, you know, as far as this little dog walk here right now. Um, he'll do his obedience behaviors off of it. Yes. This has helped us work with him quite a bit too on his length of stay. Again, it's helping him develop a little bit more coordination with his body, which makes him more comfortable in new situations. Yes, midnight, come. Yes, good boy. Good boy. Been working with getting him jumping on the things a little bit more. Sit. You know, this table is not terribly tall of a jump to get on and off of, uh, but it is something, you know, the first couple times that he tried it, it was a little bit high, it was a little bit intimidating to him. Down. Yes, good boy. Again, just learning a little bit more on his body placement. This is going to help him with a lot of his confidence overall. I know we've been working with him on food bowl issues, um, but you know, the food bowl when it's outside, it's shiny, it makes a lot of noise. So if different objects have started them a little bit. What we've been kind of working on him with that is just helping him realize that just because him from having his difficult time when he's out on the street walking, hears a car backfire, um, other kinds of noises. And we'll continue to work with him um, on increasing these distractions even more this week. So look forward to some exciting work with Midnight getting him out more.